In a world where technology dominates every aspect of our lives, the dynamics have become notably dark and manipulative. Imagine this as the plot of a science fiction movie, but where you are the protagonist. Have you ever wondered why attention has become the most valuable currency in the digital era? We are about to reveal all the secrets. But before we dive into this fascinating universe, let me share something. The key to your satisfaction and success lies in how you direct your attention. Over the years, I have discovered that every moment of our attention matters a lot. So get ready for a journey where we will explore the technology revolution and how, amidst this confusion, you can take control of your attention to transform your life. Throughout this episode, we will delve into the world of conscious decisions, avoiding stimuli that try to steal our time and attention. Discover how technology can be a powerful tool when we learn to direct our gaze towards what truly matters. But this is not just information. It is an invitation to a change of perspective. Are you ready to unleash the potential of your attention and stop being a victim of technological manipulation? Then, join me on this journey. Remember, on this channel, we not only explore the technological present, but also create the future we want. Like, subscribe, and activate the bell so you don't miss any updates. Let's start this journey together. I understand that the way I manage my attention directly influences my satisfaction and success in life. I am attentive not to succumb to stimuli that, after touching my reward system, make me more insecure, lazy, conformist, and dependent. Especially stimuli of a sexual nature are authentic destroyers of development and mental health, having the power to absorb and retain our attention, excessively sexualizing our thoughts. This constant focus on sexual matters 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, prevents us from concentrating on other important areas of life to grow and make significant changes. It is crucial to learn to control attention and sexual impulses. Over the years, I have advised various people, and I have observed that those who truly grow and feel good about themselves are those who can control their attention. This requires self-esteem, self-confidence, and the ability to control sexual impulses. Now, I will share five steps to desexualize the brain and regain control of attention. Reduce sexual stimuli. Eliminate unnecessary sexual stimuli from your daily life, especially pornography and sexualized content on social media. Set goals and tasks. Keep the mind busy with goals and activities that promote personal growth, thus avoiding free time that may lead to exposure to unwanted stimuli. These are the first steps to regain control over attention and promote healthier development. I can assure you that when your life acquires a purpose and seeks a specific future, sexuality ceases to have that excessively glorified image associated with the number three. Directing your attention towards people who attract us is a natural behavior. Our reproductive instinct programs us to look at them. However, there is a significant difference between appreciating their beauty and becoming one of those individuals who cannot stop constantly seeking, even going so far as to take an indiscreet look at the intimate parts of the person as they walk away. These behaviors seem quite ridiculous to me, indicating an extreme sexualization of the brain and a complete lack of self-control regarding attention. If you want to improve in this daily battle that our minds subject us to, it is crucial to learn to control your attention both at home and on the street. This will make it clear that a man is the master of his destiny to the extent that he is the master of his attention. So, when you go out on the street and encounter someone who piques your interest, stop contemplating and imagining intimate situations. This will only cause suffering. A friend of mine has a magnificent rule for this. If he sees a woman he finds attractive, he looks at her once, but if he looks a second time, he has to approach her and start a conversation. This forces him to increase control over his attention or face the discomfort of starting a conversation with an acquaintance. This approach is effective in avoiding obsessions and excessive sexual thoughts. Approaching conversations with attractive people without seeking specific results is the recommendation. Talk to them, get to know them as human beings, interact without expectations. This will allow you to establish authentic connections and develop more meaningful relationships. Practice number five is focused meditation, a powerful tool for controlling the mind and thoughts. Dedicate at least 10 minutes daily to actively observe and consciously release intrusive thoughts. 
This will help develop greater mental control and reduce the constant sexualization of thoughts. In summary, excessive sexualization of the environment, especially in the digital medium, can pose a threat to well-being and mental health. Taking control of attention and practicing the mentioned five steps is crucial to desexualize our brains and regain mental control. Remember, you are the master of your destiny to the extent that you are the master of your attention. If you enjoyed this, don't forget to activate the notification bell, like, and subscribe to the channel. Until next time.